Do you know New Year's is next week? 2020 is next week. Let me tell you, this holiday is one of the worst ever. Because um, December holidays kind of cheats you that you have a whole month of December for a holiday. Then it only turns out to be like five, six days, you know. Uh, but yeah, 2020 is next week. And the worst thing about it is when you look back and you're like, what the hell have I done in 2019? You know, okay, I know you hustled and you know you did all those things. Eh? But then you ask yourself like, what are those things I did for me to make me happy? You know, not just the usual grinding and trying to make money and see what, but, you know, what are those things that you did that, you know, brought real happiness to you? And the way the world is set up nowadays, you know, it's only when it gets to the end of the year that when you try and look back and you ask yourself, 2019, man, was I really happy in this year? Like, what did I do to, you know, what's that thing I did that made me happy? So I'm going to try, me for me, I'm going to try in 2020 to purpose to find things that make me happy, you know, that bring joy to my soul, you know, uh, apart from the usual things. And I'm not talking about really clubbing and I don't know what, partying, nah. You know, things that really bring life uh, to your soul, you know. So for me, I'm thinking, I tried this in 2019. It worked for two or three months, but then, you know, life took over, so I fell off to the side. But for me, 2020, I'm thinking about trying to do one new thing every month. Just one. No, I don't want to complicate it, do a list of 56 things, no. Just try and do one new thing every month. So, for example, um, one of the things that I've wanted to do is travel. And not to travel out of the country, but travel within Kenya. Can you believe I've never been to Lamu? I just see people's pictures, Lamu, Lamu, this, Lamu. I've never been to Lamu. So, you know, I'm going to try at least to travel to one place every month that I haven't been to. It doesn't even need to be far. It could be another estate I've never been to, even in Nairobi, you know. Just go to one new place uh, every every month have you have, have you ever been to kenya national archives no eh? yeah um you know but that's what i'm saying like you know there are places to discover that we just take for granted so i'm going to try at least travel to one new place every month i'm also going to try one new dish every month i'm going to try and eat something different my palate is like you know i'm very limited um i'm going to try and eat one new dish every month um for a whole year that's just 12 dishes you know so i'm going to try as, and be as creative as i can with that then um i love hiking so at least try and find one place to hike at every month and by the way hiking is not expensive there are a couple of guys who organize expeditions for like 3k you know and they take you to these amazing places i didn't even know like there are like five six different mountains to hike in kenya i didn't even know that you know so yeah uh, I'm going to try and do all that. But that's just me. I'm just going to try and do one new thing every month uh, that brings me happiness, that makes me happy, you know. That thing that um, is just, you know, just to be a bit more selfish with my own happiness, you know. So that's what I'm going to try and do. I don't know about you. What are your resolutions for 2019? Because, uh, sorry, 2020. Because people think resolutions is just a list of things you write down and then, you know, you forget about them when the year comes. But resolutions are like babies crying in church. Both need to be carried out immediately. 